Down 12 here in the fourth. Defender falls. LeBron three. Rebound by Porter. Denver with the timeout. We are tied. I love it. Don't call it. Tie ball game. Worst can happen. We go to overtime. Murray makes a move. Game's out. Talked about no timeout here. Jamal Murray with the step back over the seven-footer Anthony Davis calling game. Reds with the call for the mid-range the whole time to get him back on track. He hit two of them, got some layups, hit two more. The last two biggest shots of the game were mid-range shots for Murray. Was nine of 24 in game one. Rolls down for Hart. The Knicks up by three. Ten seconds left in game five. Maxi fires! He's got it! Tie game! Eight point one to play! 41 for Maxi. Three seconds left. Brunson, two seconds. Brunson at the horn! It's blocked! Overtime at the Garden! Philadelphia is not done yet! Tyrese Maxi comes through in the clutch! And I, I guess that's the play they work on at the end of games. Maxi steps up big from the logo and knocks it down. He has been fantastic in this fourth. Wow, we got a game. Knicks fans are stunned at MSG. Philly's got life. Rebounds for the Dallas Mavericks. Irving dancing, prancing, pulls up, three-pointer. Bang! And a foul! The brilliance of Kyrie Irving on full display here in game six. He's got P.J. Tucker not knowing what direction to go in. Absorbs the contact. He's 12-0 and 0 in his career in closeout games. And he's putting them to bed almost by himself. And I'm not going to lie. When he's got it going, I'm not sure. Alexander there's Walker with 227 to play. Yeah, Bill should have pulled up his shot down or attacked Towns at the rim. Ten to shoot. Edwards. Oh, Edwards! A signature slam! Skywalker Anthony Edwards. He's at another level. Timeout. 2-12 left. Four-point game. Ten to shoot. Drives, pulls, in and out, no. Isaac with the rebound, 14 seconds to go. Shot clock turned off. Wagner, crossover, left wing, drives to the hole, block by Mobley. What a block. With 3.2 to go, Evan Mobley, one of the best in the world. Reason why he was the third pick in the 2021 draft. This here, the ability to move his feet laterally and then recover and block. And I tell you what, he bailed out the Cavs. I thought Donovan Mitchell went too soon. He left 13 plus seconds on the clock for Orlando. And, and that's been his shot. He can shoot three pointers, but like the team today, just unable to convert those opportunities. They are 0 of 9 from downtown. Lillard, step back. And, uh, but he obviously been in some big moments, come out and been aggressive, inefficient.
Lillard got him. This is why he came to Milwaukee for a chance in the postseason to have a deep run with this experienced team. Siakam has 15. Lillard. Oh, he's sitting it. Double Nemhart. Chuck Clock at 10. Lillard. Yes, sir! A master class indeed. Damian Lillard putting the team on his back. You can't have your hand down with him. There is a stoic nature in the way that he presents himself. Lillard is going off. Lillard has put up 29 points in the first half. Off balance. He's got it. It is DiVincenzo, too strong, back to Hartenstein, to Harden, and Anobi, he's going to drive it, oh! and Anobi with a grown man's jam. And he got fouled on that play and beat a little late to try to con make some defensive play, but how about the athleticism, and how about once again? Harden picks him up, shot clock at six. Dodgic, back up top to Irving, three-pointer, puts it in! Kyrie Irving with 36, it's a one-point game! Get out of his hands! Smart late switch by P.J. to get Luka off that island. Irving inside, the layup, oh! How did that go in? Mavericks take the lead! here at the American Airlines Center. And he's been called the greatest guard finisher of all time. And it's plays like this that get seven on the shot clock. George goes in the corner, falling away. Oh, it's good. Paul George from downtown. And the Clippers back up by two. That with a excellent defender right in his face a, a terrific contest from Derek Jones now here we were talking about this early Ray's got two timeouts doesn't elect to take one here interesting and here we go it's McCollum pick and roll action Nance inside extends Holmgren turns him back fifth block for the rookie sensation Holmgren And it's Williams against McCollum. Gilgis Alexander guarded by McCollum. Chisels into the paint, flicks it up and in. And contact. And even on that possession, what did they do? They forced the switch to get Jones off of Gilgis Alexander, and he's able to take advantage of that matchup and convert there with contact. 25 year with an offensive rebound here. Another tie. And again, Michael Malone to the Nuggets, electing not to call a timeout. We saw this in game two with Murray with the game winner. It'll be Murray and Reeves. Difference of two seconds, the game clock and the shot clock. Worst case scenario, we're going to overtime. They'll get your screen, Murray to try to break the time. No time now by the Lakers, they gotta go. James, a bump, a feed, a print shot, no! Zero's on the clock, the Nuggets advance! They have won! And the defense of their championship title is alive and well!
Jamal Murray, reminiscent of game two. But this one is going to send the Lakers home and to Cancun. Just a simple high screen and roll. But the difficulty of this shot, you're driving left so, and shoot. Edwards, step back over KD, pure! For Minnesota, the gang rebounding has been fantastic. A 39-22 advantage on the glass for the Wolves. Edwards, cash! <laughs> Oh, it's on, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, yeah, baby. KD loves it. Offensive foul, Drew Eubanks. Playoff intensity. <laughs> now, it's going to be one thing when they do it with Team USA. That, it's just so funny from one side to the other. KD loving it. I love the competition. Edwards again. Cash! Mitchell, three seconds left in the third. Mitchell flips it up and in at the buzzer. Donovan Mitchell with... They dropped it in to Mobley. He sprays it out to Isaac Okoro. He's got to either shoot that shot, knock it down, or make a play. Mitchell swims inside and drops it in beautifully. A bigger defender on him. And then here, just the over the top on that little uh, hop step. Bouncing at the Mobley back to get that easy lay in. 8.30 to go in the fourth. Mitchell pedals into the paint and flips it in. Don Mitchell. Donovan Mitchell working the pick and roll. I think they're trying to get Cole Anthony to guard him. He just wants to show and get back to the Strews. We've seen Suggs play well. Wagner play well. But who else is going to make a contribution for both teams to help close this game out? Mitchell, now you see me, now you don't. And we talked about who else is going to contribute. Well, Donovan Mitchell is going to keep doing what he's doing. Gives a little fake there. And that fake gets Wendell Carter Jr. Three-point magic lead. They had missed 10 of their last 11 from deep. Mitchell with the answer. Garland the rebound, able to save it to Mitchell. Carter now one of seven from deep. Mitchell cuts through and pops in another. Donovan Mitchell with 45. Well, their offense has not been fluid. They've gotten Donovan the ball, and he's done his best yet to get downhill. Mitchell, oh my. That is a ridiculous finish from Donovan Mitchell, who now has 47 tonight. Of Donovan Mitchell, Gary Scarlett slips out of the screen, and just the ability. To they have young talent and a great coach, and they have a seven-point lead in game six. Mitchell rings in a three, a 50-point night for Donovan Mitchell. Josh Hart with five to shoot. Hart tries a three, puts it in. Brunson with seven to shoot. Cross court to Hart. Josh Hart a three-pointer. Puts it in. Josh Hart. Some clutch three-pointers. And it's back to a six-point game. Now at five. Shot clock at four. Hart fakes. Hart tries another three-pointer. Oh, it's good. Knocks down another. Seven-point lead under a minute to play. Well, after seeing being reluctant for much of this game to take even open threes, Josh Hart with a ridiculously tough one here late in the fourth. Momentum shifting. It's Murray cutting oh, and oh, it in. Oh, oh, oh. oh, he just cleaved the ball through on LeBron. Reeves trying to tie it again and does back-to-back -back possessions Austin Reeves knows when to be the aggressor Here goes Murray into a nest of defenders and still gets it to go Signing posters later on here Second chance points and fast break points that has created this margin for the Knicks. Oh, oh, oh. Joel Embiid off the backboard. 
What? How about a man this size able to do this? Goes up, throws it down, and lands hard on that knee right away. Knew something was wrong. So Joel and B do take their time checking him out, getting him to sit up now. Out of two. The Knicks race it up the floor. Brunson for the Knicks down five. Here's Hart, gives it back. A tomb on Brunson. A lot of clock ticking here. Lowry got the pick. DiVincenzo comes out of the pack. DiVincenzo finds Brunson. Great defense here by the Sixers. Brunson gets a prayer of a bounce. Two-point game. Maxi hits the deck. Hart takes it from him. Shot clock is off. DiVincenzo, no. Hardenstein with an offensive rebound. Another chance here. DiVincenzo. He's got it. The Knicks have the lead again. Their defense turning into offense. What a flurry for the Knickerbockers. Well, this is just the toughness of the New York Knicks. Brunson makes a very tough contested three. It bounces in, and then they come up with a steal and get the ball to DiVincenzo twice for threes, and he takes advantage the second.